Hello Glamazons, it's me and this is just a quick random video. Um, it's Saturday and it's laundry day and I washed a faux fur throw and like an idiot I put it in the dryer. I put it in the dryer on low and as you can see it's like all matted up and disgusting. Um, it didn't have a care tag and this is the underside. The underside is fine. Uh, there was no care tag on it but as you can see the faux fur is like disgusting now. So I didn't know that you should never put faux fur in the dryer. Uh, don't do it. It's like really hard and crusty and gross. And so I've been trying to fix it. I also washed my faux fur um, jewelry travel roll. Which as you can see maybe quality makes the difference because um, this is fine. Like the fur is fine. This was in the dryer with it nice but this is all matted up and gross so what I've come up with and what you'll need to fix it is a pet brush and you can get this from um, Dollar Tree also a uh, you can use a razor comb which this one's like all gross because I've been using it but uh, yeah you can get this from any beauty supply store and I've been using a little oil sheen so I'm going to show you a section here. Let's see. Hopefully you guys can see it. You can see how gross and matted it is. So I'm going to rake through it. Just gently. Okay. And you're going to see the difference from where I worked and where I didn't. So as you can see, like there's little fuzzies coming off. So after I rake it with the comb, I'm going to go in and brush really hard and as you can see there are fuzzies all over the brush and so now I'm gonna go in with a little oil sheen just a little okay and then proceed to brush and I hope you guys can see that the faux fur is now pretty restored I hope you guys can see that so let me take this off because I have work to do but here you can see it's, sm it's smooth it looks the way it's supposed to look right versus where I didn't do it it's all like gross and matted up so before which let me focus the camera before and after I mean, honestly, it's not going to be quite the same. So, again, the first step is do not put faux fur in the dryer. Okay, um, that's your best bet is to not do that. Um, but if you did put it in the dryer, you can kind of make it look nice again, which is what I'm doing. So this looks better than that. This looks like some mangy thing that I found in the trash it's like disgusting and this is a fur throw so I've got a lot of work to do but as you can see this section is nice so matted mess and focus matted mess nice faux fur matted mess nice faux fur and so again you're gonna need a little oil sheen just a little bit you're gonna need a razor comb and you're going to need a pet brush and basically you're like forcing the hairs to go back in the right direction but again it's never going to be as soft and as pretty as when you first got it but again it looks better than this <laughs> so there you have it guys this is just a quick uh, tip on how to fix matted faux fur since I'm doing my laundry and I've royally goofed up here so you know I'm not putting this thing across my bed looking like this so yeah I'm gonna spend the next couple hours fixing this thing I hope you all have a fabulous weekend and yeah if I discover any more tips and tricks you know in my daily life I will film it so I'll talk to you lovely ladies and gents later if this tip helped you out leave a comment hit like make sure you subscribe and I'll talk to you lovely people later bye